first year experience program gives the students an introduction to Virginia Tech and also to their discipline. Each department in the university and college has the option to design their own course around first year and it gives them an introduction to a couple of different things. I think what the first year experience really does is it brings students that came from all different walks of life. You have students that came from schools of maybe 60 people to schools of over a thousand. So they each have different uh, expectations and experiences and it kind of gives them a place to normalize what college really is. Students have to apply to a particular college or university studies when they're coming to Virginia Tech. So I think this really does give them the opportunity to dig into the discipline a little bit, get a sense in that first semester if it's really what they want to do. And then if they decide they want to do something else, they have the time to pick that later. The advantage for the library is we have a chance to reach the majority of the students and puts everybody on an even playing field. It also does give them a really good introduction to the disciplines that they'll be working in, the resources that are available to them, like the library, like career services, and again just gives a really good overview for someone who is on campus for the first time. They're introduced to library databases, to spaces in the library, services we can use. Most of the students coming to the university come from very small one-room libraries, and when they come here, they have access to 19 times the resources that they had in um, high school. I think the biggest benefit really it is it's giving them everything they need in order to succeed. Now they still have to make the effort but they at least know resources available. I mean even with career services most students when they're entering in they kind of have an idea of what they want to be but then I've even seen students change when they they see a new major or a professor comes in and talks about their area of research and they say wow I really want to do that now how do I do it and then there's this whole support network there to help them achieve a new goal that they might not have known that they had. Students use the research and use research methods to solve a problem. That is the way the class is laid out and that's really the way it's presented. So problem solving is a huge component and while it is separate from inquiry, or information literacy, it's really integrated with that idea. Evaluating information is one that also throws them for a loop because they think, well, I found it, so therefore it's good. So how do you validate what the resource you're using, why are you using, and what of your topic does it address? Most students, when they first see a scholarly article, go, I don't know how to read this. And so we as librarians help them to learn how to take the information that they need for their courses, understand it, and apply it. Most of the classes that we work with actually are too large to even have inside the library. Um, although, the one difference would be the time that we did have the poster presentation for the College of Agriculture and Life Sciences here in the library. And then we crammed about 220 students and a bunch of administrators from the college into our multi-purpose room. And it was a really great experience. Um, but yeah, we certainly do move out onto the campus for a lot. Most of the classes that we teach take place in the students' classrooms, so they're already in an environment that they feel comfortable in. My favorite part of it is working with the students. I love to see the students come in. I love to work one-on-one -on -one with them, find out where their interests are. But the thing that I've really gotten a lot out of from this whole experience is the collaborations that I've had with my fellow librarians here. I really enjoy working with the faculty and coming up with new ways to get students excited about research and then working with the students. I mean, that's one of the reasons I got in academia. I really like working with students and watching them progress as they start kind of with that, well, I already know what I'm doing to, wow, I didn't know there was so much out there.